It's that time of the year when we're straddling between the lure of the oncoming holiday season and the pressures of the quarter. And this time around, we have an added pressure in the form of demonetization. But if there's one thing which is much less affected by demonetization, it's people's love for Derby. And that's exactly what we have for you today. We're at Mahalakshmi Racecourse to witness the first Indian Classic race of the season. So let's go straight inside and take a look at all the action straight from the field. Hosted by the Royal Western India Turf Club or RWITC, the first edition of the Indian Classic for the Mumbai racing season 2016-17 was held last weekend. The event, sponsored by Gitanjali Gems, was marked by the presence of the who's who of the city's social as well as corporate circuit, putting to rest all the doubts regarding the turnout this time around due to demonetization. For the racing fraternity, it means a lot. It means some of the top horses in the country run. Today's race could be reckoned as one of the top 10 in India. The attendance looks good and after the demonetization, the crowds and the betting has gone down. So I'm encouraged to see the numbers and the excitement of the past. We have been association uh, associated with the race courses here for a long time and a number of occasions we have worked together uh, to launch some new initiative, new activities from Gitanjali and RWITC is very, very supportive. Mr. Jain is very, very supportive and uh, it's a win-win for both of us. Apart from the owners of various teams and of course the ones who came to bet, the event saw several Derby enthusiasts who came to support their close ones whose horses were participating in the race and of course to unwind. But they couldn't really take a break from business as demonetization continued to be the hot topic even at the soiree. Whether it was the attendees, sponsors or the hosts themselves, no one could help but address the elephant in the room. Demonetization has had a severe impact. As we know, racing and betting is a 100% cash business, so it's tough to correct that overnight. Sure, there should be some sort of impact, uh, but the die-hard bettors will not give up. You know, they, they'll go for it. So they'll find a way to find out. The awards were given away by one of Gitanjali's brand ambassadors, Urvashi Rautela, along with the CEO of the company, Sanjeev Agarwal, and Chairman RWITC, Vivek Jain. Find us on Facebook at facebook.com slash etnow and don't forget to click the like button. You can also follow us on Twitter at etnowlive. To stay updated with all our programming, hit the subscribe button on our YouTube channel by logging on to youtube.com slash user slash etnow.